All right, what you see here is a new fan I got from the anonymous eBay seller. This is a Hampton Bay grit and tooth sealing fan. I've been looking to get one of these for quite some time now, just didn't want to pay too much for one because when they sold these brand new, they weren't really that expensive. They're like, I mean, the last time I remember before they were discontinued, they were sold for $25 or $24.99. And such so um yeah this fan i remember seeing in 2002 in the catalogs but my local home depot didn't have it on the display at the time they put it up on display in 2003 however they did have it being sold there they just didn't have a display model of it yet or a model on the display that is because i there's been some speculations where some of the models are actual ceiling fans and then some of them are just display ones where they actually don't around if you can like, turn them on at a pole chain or if they, even if you were to wire them as if they were to run they still wouldn't work and such but um yeah one thing i do like about these a little bit more than the great in one is that these can be flush mounted so i do feel that is a one good thing about it compared to like that's an improvement about it compared to the great in one now some people don't know but there this is actually the fourth version of the great in there's the great in the great in two from 2001 and the great in two but before the um 2001 model there was another one before it that looked more like a heritage specter i think it was called or some spinner motor fan of integrated white um the nick tube fans he has a video of one so that is actually a great and we do have pictures of a, of one new in a box but um yeah these are really big childhood fans for me and they haven't been really on the biggest want list of mine but um i figured since the person i got it from was willing to give it to me for dirt cheap basically i figured i'd grab it so um yeah now this one's a bit newer compared to when these first were introduced in 2002. one thing you can tell is it has chrome pole chains and not brass ones and there's the football globe i've always found a bit interesting with them. one thing that i'm not thrilled about this one being a newer version is that it has the that um intermediate base socket that they were using around 2006 and 2008 era here's some tags there looking at the ul sticker this fan is from april of 2007 and there's another tag up here. That says 2008, as you can see where that is. Oh, yep, yeah, there it is. 2008, you can see it. It's kind of, um,. April 2008. So this is probably one of the last ones that was being sold. I don't know. I think these were sold up until like to maybe 2009 was the last year or 2010. But I do remember seeing a video in 2012, I think, of home. De I think it might have been an archive video though, where they still had this on display. This was back in like 2011, 2012. Um, they might have been sold up in 2011. I'm not sure why I don't remember, considering how these were a fan I considered to be major childhood fans. But it was one of those years. Either 2008 was the last year that they sold these, or 2011. I'm pretty sure it was 2008, but I could be mistaken. But um, yeah, that'll be it for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and stay tuned for more videos to come.